Hello. Okay, success. Melissa, you too. I think YouTube is overwhelmed today. Okay, yes, Lexi can hear me. We're back, success. Yay, it's working. Thanks, y'all. Good morning. Whew, okay, that, that made my armpits a little sweaty. Jossie, welcome back. I'm so happy you came back. Oh, and you too, Robin. Okay, good, thanks, Anna. Oh, thanks, Kat. I love you too. Welcome everyone. Get some, some music going. Hi, Chelsea. Yes, I know I just turned 30 today, so I'm super pumped. My Thursday tickle for you is, uh, what does the, what does the uh, crab do on his birthday? It celebrates. <laughs> Oh, thanks, Lexi. Oh, hi, Christy. It's so good to hear from you. I wish I could see your face too. From Italy, oh my goodness, wow. Oh my gosh, Emily Mitchell from Charlotte and your little one. Yes, Jesse. many happy returns. I'm so happy you're back. We're gonna layer on to what we did last week, so I'm super pumped. Hello from Houston, thanks, Melissa. As you're signing on, yes, please say hello. Let me know where you're coming from. Hi, Jess. Oh, this is so, so great. Sunny San Diego. Oh, you're up early. Hi, Steph. From Chicago, Morgan, welcome. Thank you, y'all are so sweet. Oh, thanks, Beth. This is so fun. <laughs> Thank you, Chelsea. I know it's it's kind of a gloomy day in Atlanta, so I, I appreciate the, the sunny vibes. Colorado Springs, welcome Jeff. Brooklyn, Emily, I hope you're doing well. Thank you so much. Y'all are so sweet. I brought my plants back. Neil, welcome back. So good to have you again. I'm happy to see some, some recurring students back for some yoga sculpt this morning. Thank you, thank you. Tatiana, I see you, you came back. Yes, keep the jokes coming. Those, those are, those are the one thing that I can, I can give to you for some laughter in the morning. Friends, I know we're, we're signing on and, uh, oh my gosh, Brooklyn buddies. We're gonna get started. It's time, it's time to do the yoga now. Oh, from Minneapolis, that's my hometown, I'm from Minnesota. Thank you so much. All right, thanks, Amy O. Oh my gosh, so many friendly faces today. Okay, I'm gonna get our music going and we're gonna get started, y'all. I'm Kayla, I'm gonna guide you through this practice. I'm tuning in live from uh, Atlanta. So let's get started in extended child's pose. Come to your hands and knees. Bring your big toes to touch. Julia Khan, welcome. And settle in. Hey, I love you too. Crawl your hands nice and long in front of you. And once you kind of move around, get settled, just give your forehead a little massage side to side. Let your mind, your brain wake up. One deep, full breath in. Open mouth, exhale, let it go. One more, just like that, breathe in. Reach your arms a little bit longer to lengthen your spine. Breathe out, sink your hips one inch deeper into your heels to help open up your hips. Shift your weight forward now, find a tabletop pose. Stack your shoulders right over your wrists, your hips over your knees. Inhale, cow pose. Drop your belly down, start to look up. Exhale, cat pose. Round and curl your back. Tuck your chin up into your chest. Couple more, just like that. Inhale, cow pose. Release, squeeze your shoulder blades together. Exhale, cat pose, round and curl. Dig your chest up towards the ceiling to curve your back. Last one, inhale, cow pose. Drop down, open up through your throat. Exhale, cat pose, round and curl. Dig your belly up into your chest. Good. Come to a neutral spine now. Extend your left leg out to the side. Dig into your whole foot. Inhale, reach your right arm up towards the ceiling or sky, wherever you are. Exhale, wide thread the needle. Bring your right arm through your chest. Set your cheek down. Hold here. 
just another visual for you as you work into this. Options, you can take your left arm up, take a little half bind to help facilitate the opening of your chest, or maybe even press palm into palm to spread your arms even longer. Wherever you are, get rooted in your left hand. Inhale, reach your right arm up towards the ceiling. Exhale, come back to neutral tabletop. This time, take your right leg out to the side, press into your whole foot. Inhale, reach your left arm high. Exhale, wide through the needle. Bring your left arm through your chest. Options here, maybe an arm up, back and around, or press into your palms. Wherever you are, anchor down into your left shoulder, and from there, twist from your lower belly, your spine, your chest. Good, get grounded into your right hand. Inhale, reach your left arm high. Exhale, tabletop, come back. Okay. Inhale, curl your toes under. Exhale, downward facing dog. Lift your tailbone up. Feel free to pedal out your legs. It is the first down, at least of this hour, together. It might feel good just to take on any movement that feels good in your body. The good news is that it's for you, so move as you need. And then take on stillness in your downward facing dog. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, right go, Uttanasana pose. Walk your feet right behind your hands. This time, grab and interlace your fingers behind your low back. Let your head hang heavy. Keep a slight bend to your elbows so that you can keep palm to palm connection. From here, inhale, just halfway lift, pull your chest up, anchor down with your knuckles. Exhale, fold back over your thighs, let your head go heavy. Good, one more. Inhale, drive your knuckles one inch farther away from you to help open up and broaden your chest. Exhale, fold just a little bit deeper. Good, drop your hands down to your mat. Bring your feet together to touch. Bend your legs and slowly uncurl one vertebra at a time. All the way up to standing. And then bring your hands together. Close your eyes for standing at attention or equal standing pose. Last week we talked about putting every minute on trial in an effort to reclaim who we are, our essence. And today, uh, I'll encourage you to zoom out just a little bit and to ask yourself the hard questions. What is my purpose? And as you move for the next 60 minutes, dedicate just to exploring those hard questions. Continuing to zoom out, but putting every every movement, every minute on trial. Full breath in. Open mouth, exhale, let it go. Good, blink your eyes open and we'll start to move. Inhale, mountain pose, Tadasana. Reach your arms up towards the ceiling or sky. Exhale today, baby back bend. Open up through your heart center. Cactus your arms to 90 degrees. Inhale, mountain pose. Pull your arms, chest back forward. Exhale, forward fold. Guide your hands either through your heart center or wide. Step your right foot out. Inhale, reverse crunch. Bring your hands behind your head. Hold and breathe right here. Take a slight bend to your legs. Peel your chest up by using a little bit more strength in your upper back muscles. Good, inhale right here. Exhale, high to low plank. Step your right foot back in. Plant your palms. High plank option, low plank on knees or hold. Inhale, upward facing dog. Uncurl your feet. Exhale, downward facing dog. Good job, let's work Sunday, let's flow that. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, forward fold, move forward. Inhale, normal halfway lift, or regular halfway lift right here. Hold and breathe right here, okay? Find pressure in your hands, and then use that same strength in your upper back, but squeeze at your inner thighs. Good, inhale, exhale, fold. Now for real, we'll flow. Here we go, inhale, mountain pose, Tadasana. Exhale, baby back and open up your heart center. Inhale, mountain. Exhale, forward fold, take your chest down. Inhale, step your right foot out, reverse crunch. Exhale, high low plank, step back, plant your palms, squeeze your elbows back towards your ribs. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Let's do that one more time. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, forward fold, move to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, mountain stretch. 
more openness. Exhale, downward facing dog. Good. Take a deep, full breath in. Open mouth, exhale, let it go. That's it, y'all. Yeah. Inhale, knees forward. Exhale, forward fold, move to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Yes, sun B, y'all. Inhale, chair pose, utkatasana. Bend your legs, take your arms and chest up towards the ceiling or sky. Hold and breathe right here, okay? Draw all of your weight back into your heels. And I know I can't see you, but chair is the, that one that takes a little bit of fidgeting. Trust yourselves and just sit into it. Dig deeper into your breath and connection that every time you get into this, you can get right into it. Really feel the posture. Center your focus forward. Good, inhale. This time, this week, exhale, lat, pull down now. Just take your elbows down and squeeze your shoulder blades together. And even though you don't have any weight there and things right now, pull your elbows back like you really mean it. That's it, inhale. This time, crescent lunge, reach, send your left leg back, reach your arms forward. Good, hold right here, three. Good, be on the ball of your back foot, so it's almost like you're pulling your chest forward. Draw your weight into your right heel at the same time to help balance you towards your left big toe. Reach your arms and chest forward for something, for someone. And then inhale. Good. Exhale, airplane arms. Just take it back. Yeah. Nothing moves other than your arms. Hold right here. Extend your fingertips and then pull your triceps up and in to help straighten your arms. Draw your shoulder tips backwards. Open up your chest. Good. Inhale, star pose, y'all. Unwind. Wiggle out your hips. Yes, it feels good. Hold and breathe right here. It feels funny at home when I'm by myself, but also feels amazingly free. Yeah, inhale. Exhale, horse pose. Bend your legs. Take your hands to heart center. As you work, yes, again, one of the time, the first time we get into horse, it feels good just to move uh, your hips around. We don't often open up this way. We don't sit this way in our desks or at our at-home offices. Put a little bit of pressure into your palms. And then draw all of your energy also up through your chest and down through your legs to help challenge the depth right away to warm up your muscles in your legs and give you a little bit of foundation for where you're going to work from later. Good. Inhale, star pose. Reach up. This time, exhale, archer's pose. Bend your back leg, your left leg. Flex your right toes and then pull your arms back literally like you're going to pull a bow as an archer. And I've never actually done that, so I'm just doing what I would imagine. Find more of your energy now, forward into your fingertips. Start your challenge, your focus, into figuring out why does this pose matter? What about this is gonna help me find my essence? Sink just one inch lower. Good, everything's gonna move. Inhale, double lunge with a shoulder press. Press your front toes down, pivot, bend your back leg, reach your arms up. Yeah, that's it, hold and breathe right here. Okay, keep both of your knees bent to 90 degrees. Draw your hands right over your shoulders. I already feel a little burn in my back leg. Let that burn. Let that challenge and start to fire up your discipline, your tapas. Inhale, fill up. Exhale, low lunge. Plant your palms. Start to straighten out your back leg. Good, now get grounded into your left hand. Inhale, side plank. Reach your right leg back. Extend your right arm high. Hold right here and breathe. Scoop up on your left side and then reach your fingertips one inch higher to help you stabilize. Inhale, exhale, high to low plank, lower down. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. That's it, y'all. We'll do this on the other side. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, forward fold, loop to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, chair pose, Utkatasana, sit low. Right away, exhale, lap, pull down, you got it. Good, inhale, crescent lunge, reach. Extend your arms forward, right leg back this time. Hold and breathe right here. Good, push your back leg straight. Extend energy forward into your front leg to help lengthen your spine. Good, draw your shoulder blades back, inhale. That's it, exhale, airplane arms, nothing else moves. Yes, exactly. Steph, I can feel you. Squeeze tight through your triceps. Draw your low belly in to help protect your low back. Yes, exactly. We woke up this morning to get a sculpt, but also a deeper connection. When nothing is moving, how can you tap in a little bit deeper to explore through your breath? Jesse, I hear it. I know you're so far away, you're across oceans. That's it, y'all. Inhale, star pose, unwind. Wiggle it out. 
that's my booty, so I'll turn around. Yes, good. It still feels free. And exhale, horse pose. Sit low. Wiggle out your hips. Get into it. Other side, it feels just a little bit different. That's it. Good. Inhale, star pose. Exhale, archer's pose. This time, bend your right leg. Flex your left toes. Reach your arms back and then gaze over your left hand. And as you start to dig a little bit deeper, hold there. Okay. Find a little bit more pull in your shoulder blades so you can actually feel a warming, a strength in your upper back. Everything moves y'all. Inhale, double lunge, shoulder press, hold right here, breathe. That's it, bend your back leg just as much as your front leg. Scoop up through your tailbone, your pelvis to help lengthen your spine. Inhale, exhale, low lunge up, plant your palms, straighten your back leg. Wiggle out as you need, get ground in your right hand out. Inhale, side plank, reach your left arm high. Yes, that's it, hold and breathe right here. Scoop up from your oblique muscles and push into your hand. Your stabilizing hand to help you lift your chest. Inhale, exhale, high to low plank. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog, that's it, y'all. Okay, we're moving breath to movement. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, forward fold, move to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. If you've got your, your light set of weights, grab them, or maybe it's your soup cans or, or your candles. And we'll move, here we go. Inhale, chair pose. Take your, your weight-bearing things overhead. Exhale, lat pull down. Draw your elbows in towards your ribcage. Inhale, press the lunge. Reach, press forward. Exhale, airplane arms. We're not their lungs. Inhale, star pose. Bring your weights through your shoulders, through your chest. Exhale, horse pose. Get low. Good. Inhale, star pose. Punch straight up. Exhale, archer's pose. Lunge, pull, squeeze. Through your shoulders, through your chest. Inhale, double lunge, shoulder press. Exhale, low lunge. Set your weight-bearing things to the side. Inhale, side plank, reach up. Exhale, high to low plank. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. That's it. Yes. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, forward fold. Move to the top of your mat. Grab your weight-bearing things. Inhale, halfway lift. If you've got them, find a little bend to your legs. Exhale, fold. Stay with me. Inhale, chair. Exhale, let pull down. Draw down. Inhale, press the lunge, reach. Good, exhale, airplane arms, send it back. That's it, inhale, star pose, unwind. Exhale, horse pose, sit low. Inhale, start. Exhale, arches, drop, pull. Everything moves, inhale, double lunge, per shoulder press. Exhale, low lunge, weight to the side. Inhale, side plank, ground down into your right hand, hello. Exhale, high to low plank, that's it. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog, press it back, that's it. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, forward fold, move to the top of your mat, grab your weight. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold, we add on just a little bit. Inhale, chair. Exhale, lap, pull down. This time we pulse, it's down, down. Exhale, exhale, squeeze, squeeze. Keep this going, find your pulse. Yes, Neil, you've got it, stay with that. I know, my heart rate is already increasing. That's good news for you. Right there, come on, squeeze. Squeeze, that's it. Sit a little bit lower into your legs to help strengthen all the way through your lower half as much as you focus on this upper half. That's it, y'all. You've got just four, three, two. Crescent lunge reach in one. Inhale, drive up. Exhale, airplane arms. This time, you pulse your arms. Yes, it's up, up. Exhale, exhale. Drive your knuckles straight back. Even if you don't have weight, the punch, the squeeze in your hand creates enough tension. The same amount of squeeze that you would want. Yes. Exhale, find your breath. Just for four. Three. Two. We go to star pose, y'all. In one. Inhale, star pose. Wiggle it up. Good. Exhale, horse pose. Sit low. That's it. Inhale, star. Exhale, archers. This time you hold. Flex your toes. Get anchored in your legs. Archers, pulls. It's front and back, front and back, that's it. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, woo! Punch through your knuckle, drive your elbow back to activate through your upper back muscles. Woo, baby, let's go, four more. That's it, last three, two, double lunge, shoulder press, and one. Draw your 
right arm down. Inhale, shoulder press, double up. So this time, extra weight to your heart center. Tiny pulses. It's down. Exhale. Exhale. Steady your breath. Turn on your glutes. Keep pulsing. This is going to start to burn. I know. Yes, Chelsea, I know. I'm giving you all of, my, all of my energy right now directly to you so you can squeeze through your bum and sit just a little bit lower. Y'all, I hear you. I feel you. Energetically through the screen, pulse a little bit lower for four. That's it, last three. Two, low lunge. One, set your weight down, plant your palms. Inhale, side plank, open up. Hold right here. This time, take your left knee down. Hand behind your head. That's it, I'm just gonna flip so you can see this. Knee to elbow crunches. It's up, down, up, down, yes. Exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, yes. Now, as you do this, anchor down into your back foot and into your front hand so all the work can happen from your obliques and your lower abs. For four, three, down dog in two, right away. One, make your way there. Transition, woo! Okay, inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, forward fold, move to the top of your mat. Grab your weight bearing things, inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold, that's it. Inhale, chair pose, glutes get tight. Exhale, lat pull down, repulse, it's down. Down, exhale, exhale. Keep this going. Take more of an upright spine as you launch into this. Squeeze deeper into your legs. Whew, that's it. Fire up through your biceps to help keep your weight and elbows stable. For four, three, press lunge reach in two, one, just a transition. Inhale, press lunge reach. Exhale, airplane arms. Yes, you can. Pulse it up, up, exhale. Whew, that's it, y'all. Neil, you've got this. Squeeze your knuckles one inch higher. Find your breath. Can you sit just a little bit lower? The answer is usually yes. Why is sitting lower important to you today? For four, three, two star pose, y'all. In one, inhale, unwind. Exhale, horse pose. Inhale, star. Exhale, archers, hold. Flex your heels, get anchored. Punch your left arm straight. That's it, archer pulls. It's front, back, front, back. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Keep this going. I know, I know. Three. Drive a little longer. Find your beat right here. Turn on your focus, your intensity into your front knuckle. Last four. Three, wherever you are. Last two seconds. One, double lunge, y'all. Inhale, make your way up. Exhale, pulses, waist start center. Pulse, pulse, exhale. Let your glutes, your bums burn just enough. Take your left glute and squeeze it in. Yes, to help stabilize and square your hips forward. You've got this, breathe, exhale, exhale. Let your focus go to that. Whoo! That's it, kitty cat, you've got it. Breathe, last four. Three, low lunge y'all, in two. One, set your weights down. Inhale, side plank. Send your left leg back. Or your right leg back, I'm just mirroring you. Exhale, come down to your knee. Hand behind your head. That's it. Crunch it up right here. It's in and down. In and down. Yes, in and down. Exhale, inhale. Exhale, inhale. Squeeze, hook. Open, yes. Draw your elbows in towards your knee and your knee in towards your elbow. For four, three, two, down, down, in one, make your way. Woo! Transition, pedal it out. Give your back that nice release, your shoulders a nice stretch. Inhale, fill up. Open mouth, exhale, let it go. All right, y'all, come down to your knees. Set your weights to the back of your mat. We'll transition in into push-ups and biceps. Move your hands to the edges of your mat. We've got wide arm push-ups. It's down and up. Down. Inhale. Exhale. Exhale. That's it. Now, knees are an option. If you're taking your knees, flex your heels. That's it. Breathe. Woo! Y'all, I feel you. You can do this. Last four. 
and we'll find that B. You got two. One, take your knees down wherever you are. Grab your heavy weights or your same weight bearing things. Basic bicep curls. You lift, you lower. Yes, lift. Lift. Exhale, inhale. Exhale, inhale. Yes. Woo. Okay. Your option, one arm at a time. Or you can always get rid of your, your weight bearing things. That's it, y'all. Huh? Robin, you're doing so great. Lift. Lift. Exhale, open up your chest. Maybe it helps to close your eyes. Your biceps can handle all of these reps. Yes, Beth, you got it. Last four. Three. Two. We take a pulse. In one, halfway up, you pulse it up. Up. Yes, exhale. Exhale, breathe. This time, relax the grip you've got in your weight-bearing things. Let your biceps do all the flexing, the work. Yes, Amyo. Our sculpt goddess. Exhale, y'all. Four more like this is four. Three. Back to push-ups in two. One. Set your weights down. This time, we push up and we do a little swimmer's hold in between. Let's do it together. You go down. Up, hold. Down, up, hold. Down, up, hold. Down, up, hold. Still knees are on action. Lower, exhale, hold. Inhale, exhale, hold. Lower, hold. Lower, hold. Just four more, y'all. It's four. Hold. Three. Hold. Two. Hold. One more. Hold. Yes, knees down. Woo, grab your weights. This time, hammer curls, palms in. You lift up and down. That's it. It's up. Exhale up. Inhale down. Exhale. Inhale. That's it. Still an option. One arm. Yes, I know. Check in, how are you doing? Have you asked yourselves any hard questions in the last few reps? What about these bicep curls helps you get to who you are? Discovering your essence. Yes, y'all. Woo! You got this, exhale. Just four more, we can, we can, it's four. Three, we pulse in two. One halfway, left pulse right here, it's up. Up, yes y'all, up, up, exhale. Draw your elbows in to help bring the focus into your biceps. That's it, left your shoulders. That's it, last four, three. We combine those push-ups in two with the reach. In one, set your weight down. This time everything happens at once. Bring your hands just a little bit closer. Here we go y'all, you go down, up. Down, swimmers. Down, exhale. Exhale, yep, down. Everything goes. Yes, you can. Let's go, let's go. It's down. You reach, yes, down, reach. That's it for four. All you've got, last three. Come on, come on. Two. Yes, y'all. That's it. And one on your knees. Take your heavy weights. Last set of curls right here. It's a wide curl. Palms out, lift and lower. Lift and lower, yes, lift, lower, exhale, inhale, exhale. You've already trained your body. Take the options that you need. You train your body to know, right, that we're curling, that we're gonna pulse. Lift, lower, zoom out from those little specifics of movement. Let yourselves explore. Ooh, we're picking up. Lift, lower. Lift, lower. That's it. You can or you can keep your same V, y'all. Last four. Three. Two. We pulse. One halfway right here, y'all. It's up. Up. Yes, I love each of you. You've got this. Breathe. Exhale. You showed up. You made it here. Four more. It's four. Three. We got squats in two. One, set your weights down. You don't need them right now unless you're like feeling soft and you want them. We've got a sumo squat, so bring your feet at least wider than your hips. Toes turn out just enough. 
up, it's down, up, down, up, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, we'll find it, okay, we're, you know what, Maybe it's, it's going to stop, we're going to keep moving, I'm excited today, I had a little bit of coffee, so hey, squat down, squat up, let your arms move freely, Focus on bringing weight back into your heels. Exhale at the top and squeeze your glutes to help you lengthen a little bit taller. From the side, think straight down, straight up so that the squeeze of your glutes contracts in rather than forward. Straight up. Whoo, there it is. Four more. It's four. Maybe you hold baby shine your hands, lift. Let your fur baby lick your face. You got it for four, three. I know, back to sumo squats, y'all. And two, one, stand all the way up. Back to sumo squats, down, lower, lower, lower. Exhale up, inhale, exhale. We'll find it. Keep moving. There it is. Exhale, you got it, y'all, for four, three, last little bit, we pulse, in two, yes, you can, it's one, pulse it low, yes, stick your booty back, dry your belly in, put a little pressure into your palms to help activate your chest, find your breath, that's it, last four, there it was, three, two, one, shake it out, y'all. Okay, we go right into cardio. We'll get water after that. I'm just gonna give us a little bit more, a little bit more pump to that. All right, here we go. Start to jump rope side to side. Oops, that's training now. There we go, side to side. You can always do this, no jump, okay? So again, if you're in an apartment, I'm actually stealing my boyfriend's apartment every time I teach. Maybe you just step touch. Woo! Whatever you do, keep moving. One stop of cardio. For four. Three, my favorites, y'all. It's so hard, it's in two. One, let's go to the side. It's down. Switch, switch. You can always do this without that jump. You'll still get the depth. Heart rate lifted. I know we just did a squat, you got just four. Three. One butt kick here, let's go. Select your heels. Top of your mat. If you want, add the arms up. Out, up, out. Woo! Yay! Come on. For four, three, two, one. Run it out. Football runs. I know, I know. Let your arms move. Start to move your feet just a little faster. Pick them up off the floor. Yes, you can. That's it, that's it. Woo! Breathe it out, I know, I feel you. Sit a little bit lower into your legs. That's it, kitty, I see you. I feel you, I know these football runs. Yes, Steph, come on. It's four, three. Last set, y'all, in two snowboarders. Come on, find it and you dig a little deeper, it's down. For four, three, two, one, good, jog it out, Whew. catch your breath, top of that, add the arms, that's it, that's it, 
one, listen. Step it out. Side to side, hands behind your head. Give yourself a nice breather. It might be lifted, might be lifted, it's okay. Full breaths in. Full breaths out. I love you all for doing this together. Well, you can't see each other. That work, it's felt. Good, step touch just for four. Three, two, one. Grab a sip of water. Find your device. Chat in some sort of encouragement. Yes, Robin, I feel you. Find someone, maybe it's Janelle. Yes, Janelle, so good to see you. Oh, tell them they rock. Breathe. It's like if you were in the studio and your teacher tells you high five that person and that first second you're like, Meh, and then you have that awkward like pause, like find someone, tell them that they're supporting you, that they're helping you. We got this, yes, Tatiana. Okay, keep it coming. Santa Barbara, nice Fiona. Okay. Thanks, Judith. You're all doing great, yes, Anna. All right, it's time. I love the, the kissy faces. Yes, dying early morning. Okay, keep them coming. Keep them coming, y'all. Woo! All right. When you've said your encouragement, when you felt it, re-grab your, your weight-bearing things. We'll transition. Maybe top of your mat, feet together. That's it, inhale, chair pose. Good, exhale, step your feet hip with distance for good morning. Bring your weights to your shoulders. It's down, down, up, up, you got it. Lower, lower, lift, lift, a little bit more for your legs. Up, up, that's it. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Bring all of your weight into your heels. Lower, pull your belly in. Draw your shoulder blades back and squeeze as you lower. Yes, to help wake up the muscles in your whole back. Y'all, just four more. Let's go. It's four. Up. Three. Up. Two more. Yes, you can. Let's go. One more. Woo, baby. Yes, now step your feet back together to touch. Inhale, chair pose. Good, exhale, crescent lunge with airplane arms. Step your left leg back. That's it, we've got shoulder walks. Your right arm is presses forward for two. In, press, in, press, in, press. That's it, pull, press, pull, press. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Keep this going. Breathe, draw your belly button in. Drive your knuckles out every time, get longer, get bigger, and then ask yourselves, why do I need to get bigger right now? How is this helping me right here, right now? Put these motions on trial. You've got just four more. Three, crescent lunge in two. One, step your left foot back, inhale, crescent lunge. Exhale, horse pose, y'all, wiggle it out. Give your arms a breather, we got oblique twist. Front. Back, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, yes, twist, twist, Woo! relax your shoulders, let your spine be long, so that as you twist, all the work goes into your oblique muscles, you're almost there, it's twist, twist, sit a little lower, Woo! we felt that, four more, let's go, it's four, Three, yes y'all, it's two, one, inhale, star pose, press up. Good, exhale, warrior two. This time we've got upright rows. Bring your weight down, palms back, lift and lower. It's up, down, up. Exhale, inhale, exhale, yes, come on. Whew. We're so close. One arm is still your option. Exhale, kitty. How are you doing? Yes, exhale. Woo, stabilize through your front glute. Even though we're focusing right now, biceps, chest, shoulders, your 
legs still do a big chunk of our last four. Three, two, reverse warrior, y'all, in one. Take your back foot to your hip. Inhale, punch your right arm up. Good, exhale, low lunge. Pull your weights in. Draw your weights down to your mat. Hold right here. Inhale, high plank pose. That's it, hold your high plank. Breathe. Push away from your mat to help straighten your arm. Drive your back to your knees up to activate your quads. Woo, last four. Three. We lower all the way down to our bellies in two. Last one, shift and lower. Come all the way down. This time, zip your legs together. That's it, inhale, cobra pose, bhujangasana. Lift your chest up. Hold right here, breathe. Okay, be lighter in your hands than you want. Dig out through your big toes and lengthen through your spine. Pull your chin into your chest to help lengthen the backs of your necks. That's it, just for four. Last three, two, one. Chin down, y'all. All the way through your toes or knees. Inhale to high plank pose. Woo! Exhale, down dog. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, forward fold. Grab your weight. Inhale, halfway lift. That's it, exhale, fold. Inhale, chair pose, Utkatasana. Exhale, step your left leg out. Good morning, second step. Weights to your shoulders, yes you can. It's down. Up. That's it, lower. Lift. We'll find it. You inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale. Exhale, that's it. Hug your inner thighs in and back to help keep your toes and your knees straight forward. Four more. Up. Three more. Whoo, baby. Two. Yes, you can. Last one. Crescent lunge. Just come and step your left foot back. Inhale, crescent lunge. Yes, y'all. Exhale, horse pose. Turn it in, turn it up. This time, weights behind your back. Oblique dips. It's right. Left. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. You'll find it. You'll find it. Breathe. These oblique dips, we, we think of as a breather. Challenge yourselves right now to explore more depth in your actual lean, in your squeeze of your obliques, and in the depth of your squat. Yes, you can. Breathe, yes, Chelsea. You got four more. Three, Tatiana, you got it. Come on, baby. Two. Star pose in one, y'all. Inhale, star pose on one. Good, exhale, warrior two. Bend your left leg. Yes, bring your weights down in front of you. This time, rotator cuffs, y'all. It's out and in, you've got it. Out just to stabilize. It's out. Out. One arm is still your option. Exhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. You've got the chance right here to focus on the backs of your shoulders. It's less like big sexy movement than it is to help all those little muscles that we need that are just as important. You've got four more. Three. Reverse. In two. One, inhale, reverse, we're back with your hips. Good, exhale, low lunge, pull, set your weight to the side. Inhale, high plank. That's it, y'all. Hold, breathe. You've got one more hold right here. All you've got, static hold. And as your mind starts to wander, it says, oh my gosh, Kayla, get me out of this. Oh my gosh, for me to look at my face, close your eyes. Focus inwards into your heart. Where do you feel this? You've got four. Come on, three, belly down, not yet, not yet, and two, one, open your eyes, shift, lower down. This time, keep your feet hip width distance apart, hands behind your head, everything lifts, everything lowers, it's up, up, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, point your big toes back, draw your elbows wide, up, control your legs and your chest as you lower. Up. Woo! For four. Three. Two. One. Chin down. Here we go. Last one. Inhale, high plank. Four, three. 
facing the holy guacamole. Good, inhale, knees forward. Exhale, walk your feet all the way through. Take a seat. All right, y'all, it's time. It's time for some core work. Set your weights at the top of your mat. Get rid of them. Unless you're feeling extra saucy, lay down. Yes, you can. Today, yes, same thing. Supta, or recline bound angle, supta baddha panasana. Let your legs open up. Hands behind your head. Lift up and down. Up. Exhale. Exhale. Lift. Lift. Keep going. Lift. Yes, lift. Whoo, hop. All right, all right, we've got to pump up. We've got to pump up. It's happening. Yes, you can. Now, from the middle of your chest, lift one inch higher. Yes, find something on the ceiling or the sky that you literally want to touch with your heart. And as you do that, you get closer and closer to each and every one of us. I love you all so much. Keep breathing. Keep lifting. That's it. Go. Y'all, just four more like this. It's four. Three. That's it. We pulse in two. One, pulse it up right here, it's up, up, up. Find your exhale. Exhale, exhale. Push your belly down. If it helps, maybe you reach for four, three, chest to ceiling, two. Hold in one, reach, hold for four, three, two, one, chest down, take your legs in, extend them all the way up towards the ceiling, that's it, breathe, this time, fingers up, crunch up, hold, flex your toes, everything opens, everything closes, it's out, in, out, in, press your belly down, it's inhale, exhale, inhale, Exhale, that's it. Inhale. Exhale. Hook. Four more. Let's go. Let's go. It's four. Hook. Three. Scissor kicks up. In two. Hook. One. Hands behind your head. Let's go. It's right. Left. Right. Left. Keep going. Right. Left, right, left, right, left, right, left. Yes, I know, I know. This is it. This is your final work right here in your oblique muscles. Let the sweat go down your face as you twist. Explore just a little bit deeper in your lift in addition to your twist. That's it, y'all, come on. I know, I know. Breathe. Exhale. Exhale for four, three, long body stretch in two, one, finish it out, take it long, Woo! full breath in, full breath out, good, Amy O, thank you for this banana move, take it, cross your right leg over your left leg, maybe make a little butterfly out of your hands, inhale, Exhale, stretch all the way over to your side body. Unravel, press your left leg over, inhale. Exhale, reach over, stretch. And then pull your legs into your chest, rock and roll. Downward facing dog is where we meet. I know, we're not done yet, not yet. Once you find it, inhale, reach your right leg high. Good, exhale, scorpion dog, open up your hips. Hold right here, okay? Maybe you roll out your knee or your ankle. We haven't had a lot of uh, nice good opening yet, so give it, give it some love. Dig into your right hand so that more of your weight is even. Good, inhale, reach your right leg long. Exhale for a runner's lunge. Step your right foot to the edge of your mat. You can take this on your back toe or your back knee. You choose. Maybe you give some circles, some movement. This doesn't have to look a certain way. It 
should feel good in opening in your hips. Yes. And in your back quad, holding all those lunges, all those snowboarders. If you want more in your left quad, plant your left hand down. Inhale, reach your right arm high. Exhale for a quad stretch. And if your foot is like getting close enough to your hand, that's okay. Even enough of this is going to stretch your, your left psoas, your quad. And if you've got a lot of pressure in your knee, maybe you take a pillow or a blanket. Take a deep, full breath in. Exhale, twist and squeeze just a little bit deeper. Good. Release your left leg. Stand your hands down. Listen. Inhale. Exhale, wide half split. Flex your right toes. Straight on your leg. And then you can take your right hand either to the inside of your right leg or the outside. But let your right leg be just a little bit wider today. Good. Take a deep, full breath in. Deep, full breath out. That's it. One more. Deep, full breath in. Deep, full breath out. Good. Plant your right hand down right here. Inhale. Easy twist. Yes. Hold right here. Please. And then take your left hand to your left hip bone to help square your hips forward. But draw your chest up. Yes. Inhale. Exhale, come back to your wide lunge, runner's lunge. Inhale, right leg high. Exhale, downward facing dog. We'll do it the other side, y'all. Inhale, reach your left leg high. Exhale, scorpion dog. Again, options here for your legs. Keep that moving. Yes, yes. I'm still nailing all of these. Uh, all of these music things. Keep going. Close your eyes. And find just a little bit more movement in your ankles, your knees, your legs. Oh, Robin, I'm so happy then. You needed this. Inhale, reach your left leg long. Exhale, run as long as left foot to the edge of your mat. Again, option, you can stay on your back toes or knees. Allow yourself to just explore here. Start to identify what feels good and why. Robin just said she went for a run, so this feels good in so many ways. And the stretch, it reassures our bodies that we'll take care of it after it's given us some strength, some power. If you need more in your back, so as your hip flexor or your quad, Dig into your right hand and hold your left arm high. Exhale, quad stretch. Open up to your heart center. Soften your jaw. Dig into your bottom hand so that you can have some more to anchor and to lift from. One more full inhale. Full exhale, squeeze. Slowly release your right leg down. Plant your hands, inhale. Exhale, wide half splits. Straight on your leg, flex your toes. Hands can go on the inside of your left leg or on the outside. And wherever you are, let your legs continue to straighten. Pull your hips back and your chest forward. Counterbalance dance. Full breath in. Full breath out. Pull from your hip flexors, from your hip bones, rather than your chest. One more. Inhale. Exhale. Good. Slowly make your way back to your wide lunge. Inhale. Reach your left leg high. Exhale. Left downward facing dog of this hour. Any additional you can see. And inhale. Knees forward. Exhale. Walk your feet all the way through. Take a seat. Lie down. And we've got just a little bit of movement right here. Inhale. Grab the soles of your feet. And then exhale, happy baby, because it's one of my favorite poses and help opening up your hips one last time in your thighs. Maybe you give your little massage to your back. Good. Take stillness. This time, hug your legs in. Send your left leg long. Inhale, give your right knee a big squeeze. Exhale, supine twist, cross your right leg over to the left. Ooh, let your chest stretch, your arm stretch. 
collapse into your mat and into your earth. Maybe it manifests today in your apartment floor, your house floor. Maybe it's the grass. Slowly make your way back to center. Switch out your legs. Inhale. Exhale, supine twist. Ooh, some cracks that happened. Lengthen through your left shoulder and chest. Ease into the backs of your shoulder blades. Backs of your shoulders. Slowly make your way back to center. Hug both of your legs into your heart center. Inhale, curl up into a tiny little bow. Yeah. Exhale, Shavasana. Corpse pose, final resting pose. Hold there. And take on stillness. I'll guide you out of this when it's time. Give yourselves permission to take on stillness. Jennifer, thank you. Shavasana, it's our final posture today, at least in this practice together, and you're welcome to stay. If you're staying for the meditation, you can actually just stay in stillness. And if you have to move on, start to just find a little bit of movement in your toes and your fingers. Roll out your ankles and your wrists. And then extend your arms overhead for one last long body stretch. One feel good mo mo motion. Mm, thank you so much. And then roll over to either side, fetal position. Thanks, Janelle. Good to hear from you. Come to a seat, close your eyes. As you sit just a little bit taller, rest your palms in your lap, or maybe hand over hearts. And just acknowledge all of the work that you did, knowing that we pushed our bodies, we explored through movement, and started to investigate our experience on our mat. For our purpose. And as you come back to that, just draw to your mind's eye one thing that you learned today. You learned about what you are meant to do, what you are inspired to do, and why. Take your hands to your third eye center. I'm about forward to seal this practice. The teacher in the light in me honors, sees, and respects the teacher in the light in each and every one of you. Namaste. Thank you, Robin. Thanks for coming. Those of you in meditation, just stay. Be in stillness. Those of you that are moving on to your next daytime thing, thank you so much. My name's Kayla. I'm uh, coming to you from Atlanta. We'll continue to do live YouTube classes. Um, we're gonna alter soon. Um, we're still looking at timeline, but we'll be launching our Core Power Live platform. It'll be via Zoom and it'll be uh, very similar to what you're already experiencing. And I think the, the difference is the, thank you, Jossie, thank you so much. The ability to connect, I can see you. We'll actually have live video and it'll, um, 
be deeply rooted in an experience that you would get in, in studio. As you're signing off, feel free to find me uh, on Instagram. I'm at Kayla Yogi Preston. I would love to just connect with you beyond today so I can, again, see your faces and, and, and see your yoga journey. Um, I'm here every Thursday. Thank you so much, Fiona. Thank you, Christy. Oh my gosh, yes, my fish dance. <laughs> Y'all are amazing, thank you so much. If you're sticking around for meditation, just continue to find Shavasana or somewhere that's uh, a good resting. Maybe you put, thank you, thank you, put some um, blankets or, or pillows underneath your legs or your head even. And this one just uh, fully, fully released. Maintain eyes closed or just a soft gaze if that feels better. Take a couple more steadying breaths. And then start to turn inwards. So though you already might be, truly start to draw your senses, your energy inwards. And then think about someone, someone specifically, who has helped you or encouraged you to find your power or your purpose. And when you think of that first person, whatever comes to mind, start to identify how that person helped you. What did they do? What did they say? Was it over time? And what about it was supportive? What about it encouraged you to, to reclaim who you are what you are meant to do. And that could manifest in so many ways. And as you start to hold that in your heart, breathe it in, breathe it out, and then send energetic gratitude towards that person, towards that feeling, that sensation that you, that you had and that you continue to get. Send it out again with a breath, inhale. Exhale. And then continue to hold that person in your heart. And acknowledge your yoga practice as a whole. If it's meant to, to be an expression about you, about me, about us, how does realizing and reclaiming minute by minute on trial, how does this all help you realize your purpose? If we're all connected, what does this mean in your, in your zoomed out lens and your zoomed out perspective? How do you then show up for others? And as you, as you take this all in, draw to your mind's eye just at least one thing. And for us type A'ers, you might have a few more, but just the one, just the one thing that you can do today that can move you closer towards your purpose and help you show up for others. One thing that you can do today to help you Reclaim your purpose and show up for others. Breathe in and breathe out. Slowly find movement. Transition your way into a long body stretch. Roll over and take fetal position. And then transition your way up to a seat. 
Take your hands together at your heart center. Final breath together, inhale. Open mouth, exhale. Draw your hands to your third eye. Thank you so much for staying, for acknowledging the light, the truth within you. And we bow together in our essence as a whole and together as a yoga community. Namaste. Friends that stuck around, feel free, uh, if you're open to it, to type in uh, into the chat the, the one thing you can do today to reclaim your purpose, to show up for others, help each other, hold each other accountable. This experience uh, on, on live, even though we can't see each other, just knowing that someone else is out there. Thank you so much. From Italy, Tatiana, words of affirmation, I love that. What is the one thing you're doing today? What's the one thing you can do? Or you've already done? To reclaim your power and to show up for others. Again, I'm Kayla. Thanks, Neil. Thanks for coming back. I'll be here next Thursday. Uh, the platform uh, is coming soon. Core Power Live, so keep your keep your eyes peeled on corepoweryoga.com or our Instas. Remove self-doubt and find confidence to overcome challenges. Iris, thank you so much. Tatiana, thank you. Words of affirmation for you, thank you. Thanks, Katie. I see you came back. Well, I'm so grateful. Continue to type in your one thing and, and then keep your eyes again peeled for Core Power Yoga live via the Zoom platform. It's coming. Thank you for joining today. Thank you, Lexi, for being our moderator. Okay, there may be a delay, but oh, Melissa. Yes, thank you for showing up. Okay. Love and kindness towards everyone. Yes. That definitely reclaims our essence, our power. Okay, friends. Until next Thursday. Until your next Thursday tickle. I'll see you on your mat next week. <laughs>